Hello everyone, today in this video we will be discussing the 10th uh, lab program which is to write a program on datagram socket for the client server to display the messages on the client side typed at the server side. Okay. So here what we have is our client and the server. So this is the uh, server side. We have to open two terminals. Okay. In the first terminal we will have the client and in, uh, in the second terminal we will have the server. Okay. So whatever message we type here, like if you type here hello, that should be printed here also. Okay, it's like sending this data from the server to the client. So how do we initialize this one? For that we have to write two codes for the client and the server. Okay, and in this we'll be using the UDP protocol. Okay, so let's uh, see the code part. In the code part we need to define two codes. One is for the receiver, which is nothing but the uh, server. And another one is the uh, sender. Sender is the client. Okay, so let's see uh, what happens in this code. In this code, our main task is uh, to get the message from the user and send to the server. Okay, get the message, send to the server. To get the message, what we will do is we will store the message in DS. Okay, DS is just a protocol to store the message. Okay, but actual message will not be stored in DS, but it will be stored in the spring. Okay, DS is used to pack the message and send it, uh, send it to the server. Okay, for that we will be writing uh, datagram socket DS is equal to new datagram socket. Okay, here scanner will be used to take the input from the user and it will be shown as enter the message. This is an infinite while loop where we will be taking the message from the user until user enters the uh, enter. Okay, means the new line character. Okay, when the new line is entered, at that time it will stop taking the message. Until then, the address is uh, defined 127.0.0.1. Uh, okay, so this is the uh, IP address and by using this IP address, we will be connected locally and the datagram packet dp will be initialized so in this packet the data will be sent to whom it will be sent to the server okay so these are the four uh, parameters which you have to include message dot get byte the message will be transferred to the bytes and that will be sent and the length of the message is uh, defined here and ip is the ip address which we defined here 127.0.0.1 and 3000 is the port number by using this the datagram will be uh, stored in a packet and then we will be sending the packet to DS. DS is nothing but the server. Now what happens in the server side? Server side is the receiver. Right. So here what we will be doing is. We will be having an array here. So whatever message we have sent that should be displayed. Right. So here the message will be displayed uh, by using our DS packet. Where whatever data we have sent that will be received here. And then uh, the data will be printed from the character 0 to the length. Okay. Means from the starting to the ending position. And buffer is the array which will have the data stored in it, and 1024 is the limit. Okay, so here the system dot out dot print ln the message will be printed, and in the client side, uh, in the client side you'll be able to see the message. Okay, so this is all about uh, the 10th uh, lab program of uh, 18 C 7 and thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.